Many of you have been asking about Austin's knee. His leg is massive. It's huge. He should have been laying in bed more, but he's been up trying to move around a little bit. And uh... have marked all the dolphins that we're gonna see today they know their names they know their genetic history and they track them so she knows a ton about them I'm super excited to hear what she has to say about all these dolphins it's gonna be a great day They gave each of the kids a little piece of homework, a little bit of dolphin knowledge that we're going to learn on the way out here. So there's just some questions on this pamphlet. So what kinds of questions are on here from? Are dolphins fish or mammals? Where do I write the answer to that? Are dolphins fish or mammals? Where do I? I just told you the answer to that. Do you know what it is? The mammal. Yep, they're mammals. Good job. Just maybe circle it. We're learning all sorts of things about dolphins. There's a book full of dolphins that they track each and every year. They can name them off of their dorsal fins. Uh, depending on how they look, that's how they know who is who. And we found the epitome of a mother dolphin. Amanda found. <laughs> Poor thing. This is what a mother dolphin would look like, of course. She's given all of herself to her all children. All worn out and tattered. <laughs> I we can't. spotted our first dolphins. There they are. Did you see it come out? Yeah, I saw it. They're kind of come. They said they're only in two feet of water right over there. Whoa. Oh, there it is. Coconut. It's on his back, you can see his white belly. Yeah. What do you think, Owen? Give us your thoughts about dolphins. I think that Tubby and Wyatt are good brothers to each other. <laughs> okay. And Tubby and Wyatt are dolphins. Yes, yeah. Uh, people just need to sit down and look for the dolphins. People need to sit down. Not stop running around. found? Yeah, there's 13 now. 13 now? How many are we supposed to see on here? 18? 18. No. That means we have five more dolphins to see. There's probably a good chance we've probably seen the same dolphins though, but we don't know for sure. They said that there was seven and... Six new ones? And then they said that there were six new ones. Nice. Okay. Keep watching. Callie's having a sandwich right now. Back to play with us. I just saw them. Poke their heads out. Where'd they go? Oh, there they are. They're going 
Yep, they're coming back to play with you. How many dolphins did you see on that one? Seven. Seven different dolphins. Um, you are doing great on your dolphin homework. Got all those answers? I'm going to draw a dolphin really quickly. Okay. All right, the boat has stopped for a little bit. We just got onto a little island here. I do not remember the name of it, but we are out here searching for seashells and sand dollars. She said that there is definitely gonna be some sand dollars. We just have to kind of shuffle our feet through the sand and water to find them. Carmen's on a mission to find a sand dollar that's not broken before we head home from this trip. Carmen, do you think you're gonna have better luck today and find a sand dollar? You don't know? It's kind of hard, huh? They're hard to find. Walking out here on this beautiful white sand oh, again. Sand. Look at that giant bird nest on top of that sign, Carm. It's huge. Enjoy. Holy cow. What did you find? Oh, a big shell. Oh, really big. Still no sand dollars yet, Carm? You see any sand dollars out there? Something in there? It really is. Do you think I was alive? It really is a hermit crab in there. Oh, alive. On, you wanna hold it? Callie! Farm? No? We still have not found any sand dollars. There's about a billion of every other shell out here that you could possibly imagine, but sand dollars are really hard to come by out here. Having no luck finding one for farm. It must be worth a lot of money, or at least Same a dollar. Must be. Everybody's out here collecting them or something before we can get to them. All right, we're just getting home from the dolphin excursion. Guys, it was super fun, and we found a ton of dolphins. They have like, how many on there, Carmen? 18 dolphins that they watch every single day. They take trips out, they take pictures of them. They look at them, see how they're doing, their health-wise. They have them all named. They know every everything about each one of these dolphins. In fact, the driver was like, oh, that's so-and-so and that's so-and-so. And I'm like, how can you even tell? They literally all look the exact same, but they come out of the water just enough to show the dorsal fin. And because of those, they have each individual fins and they have bites and different things like that on them. And that's how they have figured out who is who. And these people, that's what they do. They do that all day, every day. And they love these dolphins and know exactly all their needs and who they are. Carmen completed her little pamphlet thing that she was working on. And found 16 dolphins total. You found 16 dolphins total. There was three moms with calves. Three moms with calves? Yeah, mm -hmm. we saw a lot of babies out there. And they were so playful in the wake with the boat, huh? Yeah. It was super fun and to watch them play. One was Cubby and one was Wyatt. What else is in there? And then you had to cross all of these off to like the parts of the dolphin's body. And I did that. Um, this is Nibbles. He's a dolphin named Nibbles. Dolphin named Nibbles. And we know, see, they named him that because of, look at his dorsal fin. Look how many nibbles are out of it. Yep. That's funny. Are dolphins fish or mammals? They are mammals. I put whale as, can you think of another aquatic ant? Ant mammal that lives in Florida? Was so not right. she said not whales, but they have manatees, manatees. right? Yeah. Yes, they have a lot of manatees. How many years does a long ball nose dolphin stay with its mother? Three to four years. That's right. And the the babies it? stay with their moms for three to four years. And the craziest part about that is that a mama dolphin is pregnant with her baby for a full year and then only gets to have three to four years with that baby before it takes off on its own. I feel like a year is a really long time to be pregnant with a baby to only be able to keep it for three or four years. What's last on your little picture here? Oh. Is it a good idea to feed wild dolphins? No, it is not. I got that correct. You just wait to draw a picture of a dolphin or something else you saw on the ship. That dolphin and that dolphin. She drew two dolphins. Looks awesome. You were and such a good listener on that boat. These are the things that we saw. It was osprey, lightning whelk, red mangrove tree. We didn't see any of those. We saw dolphins, no manatees, brown pelican, wadding bird. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have fun on that dolphin tour? Yeah. Yeah, it was super fun, huh? And then we went exploring on the beach and got our family picture taken with the whole group. It was super fun. Yeah. And now we're home. What are we gonna do? Just hang out for the rest of the day? Probably swim. Probably. Guys, the dolphin tour was so much fun and I feel like we actually learned a lot on that tour because the lady that was helping us out, she knew her dolphins and she knew a lot about them and all of the wildlife out there. So it was kind of fun to go. It wasn't super packed, which is also very nice because normally those types of things are just packed with people and that's annoying. So. There was not very many of us on there. We got to learn a ton and the kids really enjoyed it. Many of you have been asking about Austin's knee. We are gonna give you a full update in tomorrow's video. His leg is massive. 
it's huge. He should have been laying in bed more, but he's been up trying to move around a little bit. And uh, I mean, we've been doing all these different things with icing. And uh, anyways, we'll show you his leg tomorrow. But uh, we appreciate you guys watching. We love you, and we'll see you guys back here.